Yeah, I'm here, Roderick Glover, the motivator, and I'm excited, motivated, just to play a part in your life and just take some time with you to help you get to the next level with this book called I Can Fly. Because I know that you can fly. That's why you have the book. You have greatness within you and you're ready to get to the next level. Now, I need you to say, I am the greatest. Okay, repeat it. I am the greatest. I know that you're great because I can feel that right through the CD. So you have to keep believing in yourself when people don't believe in you. And the reason why I say that you are the greatest in your movie, in your space, in your time, you are the greatest because nobody can be as great as being you than you. So embrace your greatness, embrace your uniqueness and help as many people as you can on your journey. Well, today, you know, we're going to talk about this book called I Can Fly. And I, I definitely want you to know what I can means. So I'll describe it to you. I say I. OK, I like you. You like to you like to speak out. Could you say I again? OK, that's good. I, I have to focus on myself and change. That's the I and I can. The C, could you say C? Okay, I like that. Say it louder. C? Okay, C means commitment. I have to commit to change my negative behavior. And then we say A. Can you say A? A is action. You have to take an action in order to get great results in your life. So action and in and I can. Can you repeat in? Say in again. Never give up. So no matter what happened in life, you keep pushing and you keep driving yourself to success. And the only person that can stop you from reaching your goals is you. So never give up. So remember, I can. So when people tell you you can't, you tell them. There you go. I can. You have the right attitude already. Now, today I'm going to read you this book and it's called I Can Fly by Roderick Glover, myself. And the drawings, all the artwork were illustrated by the children that are in my movie my real life princess brianna glover prince christian glover prince courtland glover and princess bailey glover and in time you'll get a chance to meet them throughout the book at the sound of the beep turn to the next page now let's go to the page that's entitled introduction Dreaming is seeing yourself being successful before it happens because whatever your mind can conceive you can achieve if you just dare to believe dare to dream Fear stops us from dreaming But dreaming keeps us hungry for life So on this journey, I need you to put on your cape your boxing glove your motivators mask and fly into the air and dream that you can accomplish any goal in life and then go off into the sunset. You know, dreaming is like flying and I know that you can fly. Go up, up and away. I can fly. If I could fly, I would go up through the sky, go up in the universe, put on my boxing glove, and tell everyone about all of my goals and my dreams. I would ask someone to help me on my journey and get a big, big hug. Ooh.
If I could fly, I would fly to football practice instead of walking through those tough, scary neighborhoods. If I could fly, I would fly past all the negative people and find the positive people and take them on my journey. I would swoop down and help the positive people. The people that really, really wanted help. If I could fly, I would fly through elementary school, middle school, and high school, make straight A's, and go to college, and fly straight to success. Yeah. If I could fly, I would pick up my mom and dad and save them from all their tough times, pay all the bills, and fly them to a big, big new house. If I could fly, I would carry my wife and children in my strong hands, build a big, big mansion, and love and hug them every day, and go off into the sunset. If I could fly, I would go back and teach other children and parents how to fly. What good is flying when you can't help anyone? I guess everyone doesn't want to fly. I love flying. But now I must put my feet on the ground, sleep, and prepare myself for my journey because I expect great things to happen in my life. Why? I already went flying. I viewed the journey and now it's time to make it happen. You know, I was always flying. I just didn't know it. But now I know. I can fly, I can fly, up, up, and away. Okay, you completed the book, I'm proud of you. My challenge to you is to go read this book to somebody else. You might go read it to your mom, your dad, your little brother, your little sister, but I challenge you to go read the book to somebody else. So that's your first challenge right there. And I know you can complete that mission. But now I nominate you as the motivator in your life. So now I need you to sign the commitment form that's in the book that you're looking at, the I Can Commitment. I need you to put your name on that commitment because you are the motivator now. You are really that person in the book with the M on their chest. That's you. So now I need you to make sure that you circle your, your educational goals. I need you to circle the one that you have already completed. And I need you to underline the one you haven't completed yet. I need you to underline it. So that means if you're in elementary school and you're trying to go to middle school, you might underline the elementary school. And then when you complete elementary school, you'll circle it and then underline middle school. So I need you to set your goals for life on what are you about to accomplish. I need your health goals, 
preventing drug abuse and, and alcohol abuse and the things that you've completed that you, that you have under control in your life i need you to circle those things and i need you to look at the goal as far as the social goal that you'll underline is about respect respecting your mother and respecting your your parents in general and your teachers so i need you to underline the thing that you're working on so if you're working on respecting your parents in life you need to underline that and when you complete it your parent your advisor your teacher can sign that goal to say that you completed it so i need you to just write down your goals and get ready for life um, i thank you for just spending time with me. I want you to be successful in life. I want great things to happen. And one day I want you to have a family and, and be there for your family and you all stay together forever. So you make sure that you circle those goals that you see there that, that you're working on in your life. If it's to save yourself for your, your husband or your wife and, and, until you get married, make sure that you circle that particular goal or underline it but anyway i appreciate your time and i guess you know it's time for me to go off into the sunset i got many things to do and i have my boxing glove on and i do have my cape and my mask on and i'm ready to fly out into the sunset i want you to remember this book and hold it i can fly hold it close to you and i want you to repeat this and this is your i can commitment i love myself Repeat it. I need you to say it louder. I love myself enough to change. Today was created for me. I must dominate every hour, every minute, and every second of this day. And yes, I must do better than yesterday, for yesterday is gone, and today is all I have. I can fly. I can accomplish my dreams and my goals. Okay, my name is Roderick Glover, better known as The Motivator. And whatever you do, be great. Peace. I'm out of here. Up, up, in the way! If you would like Roger Glover to come to your school or organization for a book reading, speech, or drama presentation, please call 615-360-6291. Again, that's 615-360-6291.